Daphna Telmer is an artist who has created color photographs throughout her career. She creates fictional landscapes based on real places by combining fragments of color negatives of different locations around the world and printing them as single scenes. By conflating these locations, she creates landscapes that are at once real, virtual, and imaginary. Here, she demonstrates how to make a color print using the chromogenic process. Daphna turns on the paper processing machine to begin warming up the photographic chemicals and water inside. Using a light box, Daphna selects the color negatives she wants to print. She carefully slices up multiple negatives and pieces together a mosaic of tiny fragments to create a new scene. Daphna then places the new negative in a holder and inserts it into a color enlarger. The enlarger enables her to create prints of different sizes from a smaller negative. She adjusts yellow, magenta, and cyan filters to fine tune the colors that will be printed. Moves the projector to create the size of print she wants and checks the image is in focus. Daphna is now ready to make a print. Because the photographic paper is sensitive to light, the next steps would normally happen in complete darkness, but Daphna demonstrates them here in the light. She places a piece of photographic paper coated in color-sensitive emulsions below the projector and switches it on. The silver grains in each emulsion layer react to the corresponding color of light that they are sensitive to, producing the colors of the print. After the paper has been exposed to light for long enough, Daphna feeds the paper into the processing machine. Inside, the print is pushed through a bath of chemicals, which activates the dyes to create the color. The print is then bleached to remove the remaining silver grains, fixed to stop the paper from continuing to react to light, and washed to get rid of the chemicals. Finally, the print is dried inside the machine and ejected. The whole process takes about four minutes. Daphne reviews the print, and depending on what she sees, she makes more prints with different color balances and exposure times. She repeats this process until she has a print she is happy with. Chromogenic processes changed the landscape of photography and made possible the vast and colorful world that surrounds us today.